Hello and welcome to this quick tutorial on how to put curves on the corners of photographs in Zara Extreme Pro 5. Um, first of all I'll assume that you know how to get into the program itself and how to load a photo. Um, here I've loaded one on a, um, a gold background basically so that you can see the, the, the overall effect once it's done. Um, okay, first thing to do is we want to go to the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle around the around the photograph itself. Now we come down to the um, thing to set to no color. Uh, that's so that you can see everything that's going on there. Um, it might be an idea to change the the color of the um, uh, the line so that you can see it a bit more. Uh, let's bring it up to about two. There you go. You can see it a little bit better, I suppose. Um, now, what we can do with this is go up to the, the, the curve corners tool, and you'll see that it's quite a large curve. But we don't want it like that. So, what we'll do is we'll bring it out a little bit so that it makes it look a bit more like a, a photograph. Um, and then we can click off there and go to the selection tool and let's go all the way oops we'll have to move that out of the way I think for a little while but anyway let's go we'll go all the way around like that select both the photo and the um, the rectangle the, the, the round corners rectangle now we can go to arrange come down to combine shapes intersect shapes and bingo the outside as you can see, has disappeared, and we've now got round, round lines. Just to show you, um, I'll, I'll put the gold background back in there, and you can see all curves. And that took a matter of moments, didn't it? And that's um, that's all you need to do, really. Um, just save the the photo where you can find it again, um, and then start on your next photo and just follow the, the, the same routine hope you enjoyed this short uh, tutorial um, be back soon with another one thank you very much bye